welcome to my bedroom. My sleeves are sexy. I look like a teddy bear. Uh, you off work? He's joking. No, no, I'm not. I really uh, like one. Oh, and we got Maggie's photos. I'm so sick of your job. From the oh, but... Your birth height. Oh. Why you gotta put your hands on me? I'm saying you need me to do what and do what? What you saying? Why are you whispering? <clears throat> I wasn't expecting that. That threw me off a little bit. Open all the doors. Oh, it's in the kitchen. Mallory, eat that bird. Mallory, eat it. He's just sitting right there. It's all her thing. Have you heard anything? Stop. 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 Well, that opens up the vlog for today. Hey, y'all. Chaos. <laughs> if you ain't trying to get a bag, then deal. See, I ain't got time for a wheel. I want a real ass who gon' stick with me. I want some real ass who gon' pimp with me. If you ain't trying to get a bag, then you. All right, so what's up, guys? I'm at home. I was about to say, as y'all can see, but I'm at home, though. Y'all can see. I don't know what those pictures are. That's who comes to my bedroom. I need to hurry up and get some chapstick, because... My lips so dry. My face dry. Anywho, I'm back home. Um, those are all my outside appointments. For the day, no more. I'm gonna be three minutes home. No more to that. These braids getting on my nerves. Cause they all in my face. I just be tying my hair in all the time. Okay. I got some meal. I got a lot of stuff to do. I what I'm trying to do fast. That ain't talking about nothing. Let me go there. The meal don't be nothing but be up nowadays, so. I look like a teddy bear. Yeah. Oh. Yeah, it's gorgeous. myself. Okay, let me go while my hair. Just out of curiosity, when do I get one of those permits that allows you to work for everyone? He's joking. No, 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 no. I really uh, like one. Oh, and we got Maggie's I'm so photos sick of your job. from the Tony's a local prison. It's just this week that I have to go like this. What's up? They're taken over a period of six oh. weeks, but all from the same vantage point. He's got a liquor. Google there. approved us sure to be a partner. So now, BSOY. I don't know if I told you that part. You or if I told Google you. And Ford. You told us that Yeah, okay. Yeah, so they approved us to be a partner. So I was reading on it more today. I hadn't did the signing of it or whatever i'm vlogging because you know, i just vlog everything and then i bleep out stuff that i don't want to know my business on. they'll just get us something something then. yeah yes because they you know the local all you i also want to know uh, the price though a 20 dollar money order no of global the, oh i think it was three something the way you said oh <laughs> i don't remember hey but um, hey buddy Body. I don't really remember. Then I signed it to my son. 
people, honey. Your breath high. Move. Move. Why you gotta put your hands on me? Look at this abuse, So, folks, put my hand out your mouth. Mallard. Okay. Mallard, green plug for you. Okay. It used to be. Oh, my baby. They don't have nowhere to tell you to feed. Yeah, this is what I'm looking at. Mm. Uh, I'm saying, or do they do like when you apply for stuff on uh, Tennessee.gov, they wait till the end <laughs> and tell you the price? Uh, now you're stepping on me. I'm right here. Why you got to be this close? Stop. Don't dimble on my watch. Come over here. Come over here. Come sit over here. On this side. Sit down. Relax. Relax. Good boy. I'm saying you need me to do what and do what? What you saying? Why are you whispering? I'm gone. So y'all, I just found out my speaking gig tomorrow that I had told y'all it's on a Zoom. It's not on a Zoom. I got butterfly. It's in person. Which I ain't nervous because I'm talking about my life. Kind of like my bad story, how I started my organization, a little bit about me, and then kind of open the floor up for questions. Um, so, yeah. I guess I gotta just kind of come up with me a skit because I do so much I don't want to get lost or confused in conversation or being nervous or whatever I don't know but that wasn't what I was trying to do right now so <clears throat> I wasn't expecting that that threw me off a little bit but it's okay my cousin plays so much he talks so much stuff to me I love it though. <clears throat> so yeah, I think that's it. Oh, let me do this. What is it called? Alright, yeah. So I've been working on this curriculum for about an hour, maybe a little bit over an hour. Um, and I just got kind of in the groove to the point where it shouldn't take me long to finish. Well, I ain't gonna say it shouldn't take me long. Cause I just am now coming up on finishing module, um, or not even the module, but um, yeah, I'm just now coming up on the point where I'm finishing the first month part, and this is a 12 month program, so yeah, but it shouldn't take me like 12 hours to do them all. I don't think it should take me that long. Um, I don't know, but I heard it fly. Because you can't make this up. Ma'am, where'd the bird go? Find it, ma'am. The bird ain't gonna get no tape. She wouldn't got her phone. It's still right there in the corner. Oh. Wow. <laughs> Right there. It's all <laughs> Oh. <laughs> Open your window or 
something. Treating his friend, he got the fuck up. Hopefully, that one gone. But we're gonna close the door next time. I'm tired. Well, that opens up the vlog for today. Hey, y'all. Chaos. <laughs> <laughs> Woo! Oh, hell broke loose. I come home, the front door open up. I gonna say, get him. I'm like, oh, let me get up in this motherfucker. <laughs> Y'all ain't gonna sit here. They freaked out because the fucking bird got in the house. What, you so, thought we was jumping somebody? I thought so. I don't know what to think. <laughs> okay, I gotta go back to You see the left school. <laughs> I heard, I'm back there working. I hear mama go, oh. She was like, what the hell was that? She didn't abandon her job, her post out there. So you check out. No phone like Miss Coleman. But you know, house. Mama voice so light and just like nonchalant. Her scream gave it. Like her voice, her scream was that too. It was like, ah. Oh. <laughs> so I really didn't pay her no attention the first time. I was like, wait. Yeah, she ain't really. That and then she went, it's a bird in here. I'm like, wait, what? Now let me and go. one, but one, she must have said No, twice. it was two. <laughs> I think the other one flew out. Oh, he in here hiding. He ain't gonna have for long when you turn that heat press on. He don't wanna get out. Mm -hmm. Then Maverick was over there getting one on. He was trying to attack it. All that stuff was in his way. So my first thing was to you got to open get you the door. Bag. And maybe one on one out the door when I open the door. Oh shit, he'll throw <laughs> I'm moving out. <laughs> Uh, band and shop again. Well, what's up, y'all? So, that happened. Didn't even open the vlog up for the morning. Yeah. Then, I done knocked, I knocked uh, feathers off the bird, honey. When it got in my room, I'll get out. 
You gotta what get out. She hit it. <laughs> All you gotta do is like let him get on the thing and. On what thing? The that bird was an angry bird. <laughs> that bird was that coming bird was for me. <laughs> that bird was that flying for a That bird, I never experienced nothing like that in my life. Hell no, that bird like mine. Is that what happened when they go in them damn places? They never come out. humans? <laughs> yeah, I ain't even know I had hit it. You know I don't got no good aim. These humans it came out of nowhere. <laughs> I said, I guess when I need to, I can hit somebody else out here. Don't eat no bread they nah, leave outside or nothing. Man, man, I was just running all over the place. <laughs> Ever. <laughs> No, shake it. It's trying to get it out. It got to go. <laughs> well, that was my exercise for today. Uh, uh. I'm in the middle of writing an email, boy. All right. It's hot. I don't know. I don't know. Okay, you guys. So I'm actually about to get this. It's 4:30. As soon as I finish this last thing, I've been doing a lot of stuff today. I don't know if I've been doing what I've supposed to be doing because I just kind of been going, you know. Copy link. Make this a QR code. Alright, y'all. So I'm gonna get dressed for my speech again. I just touched up my lashes. Yeah. Okay. And I'm going to mix Sweet Pea with Ariana Grande. And I'm going to put it Because I'm going to have new people. Just about to say an extra good, and if y'all don't know, it's a little trick. You keep your smell in for oil and base perfumes. I don't know about my nails, but I'm 
I'm actually not gonna do sweet tea. Well, I'm gonna do sweet pea on my. What is that? Okay, this is not my biggest thing. Thinking about putting a little bit of makeup on, but I'm also not. Ouch. Yeah, I'm also not interested in putting my makeup on. Let's see. of like being able to help our entrepreneurs um, have a place where they can kind of put their, their items out, present it to the public. So replace the ceilings and paint it and did this and did that. But for us, it was really about like, it needs to be a play speaker. Her name is Rilan, rhymes with Mulan. Mm -hmm. She was named after Mulan by her sister, right? By her sister, Mulan was her favorite character. Y'all see the rolling thing. <laughs> um, but Rilan is 23 years old, an entrepreneur, doing some really great things um, that she's going to share with you guys today. Um, want want you guys to understand that like entrepreneurship uh, sometimes hits all of us at different places. And so, like the really cool thing about Rilan is that she's been in entrepreneurship ever since middle school. Mm -hmm. And her uh, first business was in baked goods. So yeah, you know that moved my heart. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so, all right, Rilan, the floor is yours. Awesome, good evening, everybody. Good evening, good evening everybody. Good evening. Good evening. Good evening. Well, fresh into middle school, um, and I started out with baked goods. It was something that I just enjoyed doing. I was obsessed with cake balls as a kid, and I just, you know, whipping it up. I thought that was my thing. And it, it became lucrative from family and friends to outsiders and people's co-workers. And my mama was like, girl, wait a minute. Charge them people. Get your coin, baby. And so we went ahead and turned it into a full-scale business. From business license, registration, legitimation. And I had a business at 12 years old. And from then, just growing up, things started to change. I was no longer interested in baking. And so from the age of 12 all the way to 18, I have owned over six businesses. From baking, I was in skincare, hair care products, I do graphics and web design, social media management, photography, videography. And so I've kind of just been all over the place, right? Kind of trying to find my thing as I got older. Like what is it really that's gonna keep me involved, keep me passionate, but most of all keep my attention, right? I say that to say I am today a fully functioning adult with ADHD. Okay. <laughs> Took me a while to get in here, but that's what I have, okay? And it is all right. But over the years, what I really learned is finding what my purpose is, right? Because you can have passion in a lot of different things. Hence why I had all those businesses. I started and I stopped, right? Because I had passion for them, but you lose passion. But purpose is forever. And so it took all of those different businesses and trials for me to learn that my passion and my purpose in life is to help other people start businesses. So y'all, that was today's vlog, this vlog, this vlog. Um, I don't even know where I just came in. It really in the vlog saying that that was today's vlog, but my day is ended. <laughs> my day coming to an end. Um, got to eat a good old Klondike bar. Definitely not. I mean, they should be sponsoring me, but it's not. I don't need to be eating this. My stomach gonna be in the morning, but I don't got nothing to do this weekend, so. 
<clears throat> I can be on the toilet. <laughs> That's how cute am I. Anyway. Mm. We got our first influencer instructor partner today. Is that cute? It is. I like it. Okay. They're how to instruct it. They learn their company a lot going brand and then what they gonna teach what they teach. And then they then they go to our online app. Then this semester go to the people people. Sign up, all this stuff. Oh yeah, cold. My public speaking kid. Went great. I shouldn't start this ice cream before I start trying to close out the lava. Because I'm barely talking. The chocolate, so good. Why not do it? That's what you do. You like it. <clears throat> you don't gotta watch it. You shouldn't really have to edit ASMR. Just be the quiet. <laughs> as long as you don't interrupt like me and get to talking, you should be fine. You cannot edit it so much to the point where you don't have to have no intro. <laughs> Never speak. <laughs> like, there would be leave so much. What's the word I'm looking for? I'm losing the word. That would leave so much mystery <laughs> for people to wonder. What does she sound like? Because <laughs> all you ever hear is whatever it is. And you may make sounds like, mm, or, <coughs> cough or whatever, but to hear people will always wonder. What you sound like when you speak? And if you want to be even more whip, wear a robber mask. <laughs> I thought about making a channel without my face when I was making my bunny mask. It came out pretty cool. Definitely. <laughs> That from get go, it was gonna be creepy. Giant rodent, yeah. What's that talking y'all about? It's the same above. <laughs> That's the longest goodbye. <laughs> I'm trying to tell y'all how proud of me I am because my speaking gig went really good. I spoke very well, I didn't have no blanks, no. It wasn't a lot of ums and, and finger snap. Like, I just was so into it and so comfortable. Like, and I'm glad because I'm so, like, knowledgeable about what I'm speaking about, which is, of course, what you should be. You should speak about the things you know the most. That's what makes you a good speaker because you're educated on whatever the topic you're talking about. And because my topic today was me and entrepreneurship and starting businesses, trial and error, and that's just been my life. So... It was easy. I didn't really have too many nerves or nothing, so. Look. And yeah. I hope y'all enjoyed this video. I'm gonna go because I ain't got nothing to talk about. I'm trying to eat this quiet off. Because we got all my attention right now. So. Without further ado. I said, comment, subscribe. Comment, subscribe. Make sure to comment, subscribe.
Yeah, he